Hello everyone, it's me Luigi and welcome back to another episode of Super Metroid. In the last video, we managed to obtain the Morph Ball upgrade as well as get these sick new missiles. As you can see, the, the sprites changes. I'm still really impressed about that, although it's not like too big of a detail. I don't know, I just think it's really cool. But in this video, we'll be going around and trying to explore to see where I have to go next because I still don't know, still don't know what I'm doing here. All I know is that I'm probably going to end up dying like really soon. And by really soon, I mean like maybe even right now. Oh, you got some, some weeping going on in the background. That's probably not a good sign. Uh, we do have this map now if I click start. So I'm going to go ahead and see what's on this left side over here. Uh, and then I'm going to head upward next and then maybe go to the right. I don't know. But this beeping might get a bit annoying, so I'm gonna try and kill a few guys to see if I get a little bit more energy to stop the beeping. Of course, that wasn't enough, but uh, still not enough. Okay, maybe the next enemy that I kill might drop something a little bit better. Because so yeah, before I was not able to get in here because I didn't have the morph. Wait, why can't I? Why can't I morph? Uh. Yeah, I have the morph ball. You just need to click down, don't you? Okay, for some reason it wasn't working there before. Oh, but I can't shoot. Can I maybe just duck down? Will that work? I don't know if it'll reach. No, it won't, and doesn't seem like can't, I could get up. So, area so blocked off over here. I guess I'll just head all the way back up to the top. Oh, the enemies did respawn, so let's go ahead and shoot them a little bit more. That should be enough, there we go. No more annoying beeping sound for now. Getting actually a lot of energy here, but we can check off this little branching area. I don't know what the S stands for, maybe- oh, I was gonna say maybe a safe spot? So I'm gonna go ahead and save here, because I don't want to lose any of this data, and I don't want to have to resort to save states to have to save my progress, because I know I'll forget. Uh, that's what I had to do between this episode and last episode, because in between, it's been like a couple of days, and I had to restart my computer, or I didn't have to, but I, I did. Because I installed some stuff that needed me to re- actually, I actually don't even remember what I installed. I think I installed, like, something that- something for the New Super Mario Bros. U world editor that I was talking about. Can you break these with missiles? No, you can't. Okay, so it looks like I'm going to be heading off to the right. Because I don't really have much of an option. So yeah, I don't know if you guys were watching my- uh, what's it called? My Super Mario World series. Where I- oh, I'm getting hit. Where I talk about- the like the, the modding or ROM hacking things that I'm doing which it, I, it sounds a lot more interesting not a lot more interesting which I find really interesting it sounds a lot more like high-tech and technical and cool than it actually is it's just you know you download a program and you start editing things uh, like like you could change how the levels look or you could change how levels look it's I'm not, I'm, I'm not that advanced so you could change how the levels play you could change like where Basically, it's Super uh, Mario Maker, only you have a lot more customization, is basically what I'm getting at. You need five. That's right. Four and five. Let's see what's in this room. Another upgrade. Can I shoot you? Let's see. I have the bomb upgrade! Oh, and that means I could go back to that other area before, I think. And bomb some stuff. I didn't read what it said. Did I have to click X in this state? Let's check. Okay. Oh! Oh, okay. Hello. Uh, please don't attack me. Oh, you're trying to attack me. Okay. Use the missiles. I, uh, this is a little bit creepy. I, I liked it better when you guys didn't attack. I don't know. I think I'm waste. I was wasting that there. But, oh, oh, I thought I killed him there. He stopped and paused for a second. He is changing different colors, so I'm assuming that means that he's taking a lot more damage and he's starting to to drip, and the music is also getting louder occasionally. But I'm also taking a lot of damage. As long as you don't hear the beeping sound, I'm fine though. And he doesn't have a head anymore. Okay. And there's more beeping sounds, but he is completely dead. I didn't like that. I don't I don't like Oh, thank you for all of the energy though. That's actually really appreciated. Let's just get, let's just get out of here. Run as far away as possible. Uh, let's see, if we go in the ball like this, that actually helps a lot. I think I'm gonna get around with like that more often. But where do I have to go again? 
Let's check the map one more time. I think I'm gonna try and get up to that area right under the safe point again. Because I think the bombs are gonna be able to blow up the I guess the debris that's in the area there. Can they blow up this? Oh I guess that's they're trying to show you that bombs can. Okay, that's cool. A little bit of a mini tutorial, like a force tutorial, but without it being like an actual tutorial. And more organic that way, I like it like that. Uh, I guess these things bury their way in the ground. Do they come back up or do they just stay there forever? We will never know because I'm gonna avoid them. And I'm gonna avoid the platform too, apparently. And just keep on falling. We'll look ahead in here and see what there is. Oh, this is the safe spot. Whoops. Uh, I do not want to save right now. I need to go one more flo floor lower. There we go. Can the bombs break these open? Yes, they can. And if I go in with, uh, in the morph ball, it looks like I could also, like, I don't stand up as soon as I get through the door. I think this might be, like, another upgrade, though, because that's what these rooms seem to be. So I wouldn't be too surprised if it isn't. It, oh, just more, more missiles, it looks like. Am I gonna have to fight this guy? I hope not. Did I, is that all? Just five more missiles? Eh. That wasn't really worth the time. I'll actually meet you guys back up at the top because this might take a little bit of time. Wait! That is so cool how they show you things like that. Okay, I, I really like that addition. Uh, but yeah, I'll meet you guys back up at the top in a second. Oh, okay. Looks like I could go through here now. And that was really weird scrolling. Looks like we're gonna have some sort of hill down here. Oh! This place looks a little bit like fung fungi, fungal infected, fungus infected. I don't know where I'm trying to go with this. If I go in the morph ball, do I go quicker? No. Looks the exact same. Uh, what is down here? Uh, the, the way the enemies are placed in this hill or are, are ramp so are a lot harder to hit. But I can't aim down, I remember that. Okay. This is an energy pack, right? Do I get more energy? Energy tank, do I, like, does that increase my overall max energy, or does it just, again, okay, there's a, there's an icon above my energy meter, so I don't really know what that means, these guys are one-hit kills, right? Oh, he is blocking. Oh, hello. Can I kill you with this? Maybe when you're turned around? Oh, I'll go down like this, they'll turn around, and then I shoot them in the back. No. Missiles. Yes, okay. Looks like missiles are the way to go with these guys. Kind of sucks I'm gonna have to waste them. So hopefully this is worth it. Oh, I completely missed that missile. But I did get one back. That's, <laughs> that's nice at the least. And this left might just give me more missiles, actually. I'm gonna check the right area first, because if I look on the map, it doesn't seem like there's anything at the right. So this might be a little secret of some sort. I hope. Where is this gonna lead? This leads to an area that I do not know about. This looks like a perfect space for a boss fight. Or somewhere else. Oh, okay. Hey. Hey. Uh, I feel like I'm not supposed to be here yet. Can I bomb this? Because I'm looking at the map, and I see something underneath. No, okay. So I'm here way too early. Let's just get out of the water that I'm having a lot of time to get out of. Which I guess makes sense, considering I'm wearing, you know, like a spacesuit. And I'm trying to swim. That probably doesn't make for the easiest time to actually go swimming. Not exactly the type of swimwear you usually want to wear. So yeah, let's just go off to this left area over here. More much. Oh, okay. These guys are invincible. Okay. Ow. And this is, I don't know, but that's doing something. But it's dead too. And I got a lot of missiles for that. Can I just use missiles to break these things quicker? No, it looks like that's just wasting them. So I'm just going to shoot it. So I'm still trying to figure out what the energy does. Maybe I have like 200 energy now, or I guess 198 technically. Uh, let's go to the next floor, though. Nope, let's go to Morph Ball instead. That's not what I meant to do. So yeah, I think it might be that after I lose, like, 100 energy, 
I like the energy bar disappears and then I have another hundred. I don't know, but this is some some different music. I, I recognize the music though, because even though I don't play a lot of video games, or I don't play a lot of video I haven't played this video game, I still listen to the musics. The musics, you know, with a plural S. I do not have a map for this area though. So ow, these guys are strong. And by strong, oh wow, they're really strong. I was gonna say they're fast, but it looks like they're also doing a lot of damage, so. Uh, secret. Aha! Secret. Thank you. What is in here? Another charging? Boom, I don't even know what these are called. Map data stations? I don't know, I have more of the map though. And there's a safe spot over here. As well as something that branches off to the left. Okay. Let's go ahead and hop back in. Kill you. Is this gonna show like uh, another secret where it'll like jump up? No, okay, I actually have to go through this way. But now I know to be a lot more observant when I'm playing this game, so I shouldn't have as much trouble finding things that I'm supposed to. Uh, can I not get back? Oh, looks like I have to kill all of the enemies in this room first, apparently. No, I think that was the catch. Let's go ahead and check what's in this area. I'm still trying to figure out- oh, this is a pipe. Oh, okay, that's definitely a pipe. Hey, I'm gonna take some more energy. I'm still trying to figure out what these- oh, the little dots, I think, are for missiles. Yeah, I think that's what these are for, like, no? Looks just hasn't disappeared yet. Uh, am I- I'm trapped in here. Oh, missiles. No. Oh, missiles for these. No. Uh, no. Morph ball. Can I blow this up? Yes, I can. Oh, what, wait, why am I blowing this up? I want to go this way. <laughs> I just realized I kind of don't want to fight those guys right now. Oh, a little bit of a cheap shot there, don't you think? Oh, I, I did it again. And uh, it needs to be broken. And then I got hit by That's not even a cheap shot anymore. I knew that was coming. <laughs> Let's jump over that, though. I can't even go through that way. You know what? I'm not even gonna bother with it. Oh. <laughs> I was gonna say, fool me once, shame on you. Or shame, yeah, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Fool me three times, then just shame on everyone. Let's go ahead and get through the save point. Cause I think this will be the perfect spot to wrap up this episode. It might be a little bit longer than usual, but there's a safe spot here and I kind of have to take that opportunity to end off the video. So if you enjoyed the video, like it's always helpful. And I will be seeing you guys back here next time where we take on more of Metroid or Super Metroid to be exact.